It's a great pleasure to introduce a series of parasitology reels. I'm Dr. Manar Safat, lecturer of medical parasitology. Our topic is cutaneous leishmaniasis, or called old world cutaneous leishmaniasis, which is caused by leishmania tropica and leishmania meju, and mucocutaneous leishmaniasis, or called New World Mucocutaneous Leishmaniasis, which is caused by Leishmania Mexicana and Leishmania Brazilianesis. Firstly, transmission through bite from female sand fly, either Philobotamus babatasi or Serginiti or Lodzumoya species. And for clinical disease, site of lesion is the same as site of pathology, and lesion appear as small papule that then forms a painless chronic ulcer with a raised indurated border. And for diagnosis, history taking come from endemic area and the clinical diagnosis. Uh, about lab uh, diagnosis, scrubbing or aspiration from edge of ulcer and stained with gemcystine. Organisms are found only in the living tissue at the raised margin, regardless of the age of the lesion, and found a musty goats forms. Uh, we can do histologic examination after biopsy taking. And culture on NNN media, we can see pro musty goods. And we can do scan test, which is called Montenegro test. And also, we can do immune assay and molecular diagnosis. Finally, when we talk about treatment, cutaneous and mucocutaneous leishmaniasis treated by first physical therapy through thermotherapy in 50 degree once weekly for four weeks to CO2 later single session three photodynamic therapy once weekly for four weeks after application of photosensitizer and cryotherapy freeze for 10 to 30 seconds so and perform two to three times and repeated every one to four weeks for two to four sessions or more depending on response After physical therapy, uh, we will talk about local drug therapy. Use bromomycin ointment 15%, apply twice daily for 20 to 28 days, or use myconazole 2% ointment, apply twice daily for 30 days, or intraliginal. Antimonials injected until complete latching of border and every three then days for one to five sessions. About overall drug therapy, use as all the drugs such as fluconazole. 400 mg four times a day orally for six weeks or ketoconazole 600 mg four times a day orally for six weeks or etraconazole 400 mg four times a day orally for from three to six weeks or use a multifuzine 2.5 mg per kg per day 
or for an adult use 150 milligram orally per day given as 50 milligram two to three times a day for 28 days and about parenteral therapy use bentavalent antimonials amphotericin or a modified drug from amphotericin which is called the liposomal amphotericin to decrease its side effects and we can use bentamidine and finally we can use a combination therapy combining local and parenteral lines or combining different parenteral therapies Thank you and wishing you all of the best.